The small British company, Theon Design, adopts a patient approach to its work. Recently, they finalized their third car of the year, named GBR002, a reimagined version of the 964 series Porsche 911. Despite the limited production, this sports car, featuring a lightweight carbon fiber body and a naturally aspirated 4.0-liter flat-six engine generating over 400 horsepower, proves that the meticulous craftsmanship was well worth the wait. While the initial GBR002 is set for delivery to a customer in the UK, three more vehicles with similar specifications are currently in progress for American clients. Our admiration for Theon's BL001 from the previous year remains, powered by a distinctive supercharged 3.6-liter flat-six. However, the GBR002 takes a different approach, masterfully refining the 911's iconic air-cooled engine, making it an even more captivating automobile. Established in 2016 by Adam Hawley, a former designer for Jaguar Land Rover, Lotus, and BMW, and Lucinda Argy, a marketing and business development specialist. Theon Design creates handcrafted 964s, each requiring approximately 6,000 hours to construct, ensuring uniqueness in every build. Pricing begins at around $480,000, excluding the donor car, shipping, and local taxes. The GBR002 originated from a 1992 964 series Porsche 911 Carrera 2, undergoing an extensive transformation process. The donor car was stripped to bare metal, the chassis reinforced, and all exterior panels, except for the doors, were replaced with meticulously crafted carbon fiber panels by Holly. The original steel doors are retained for side impact protection, though customers have the option to specify all steel panels at a higher cost due to the longer hand-forming process required compared to the two weeks needed for a carbon-bodied version. The Specifics The recently completed GBR002 boasts an oak-green metallic finish, a vintage Porsche color from the mid-70s, famously chosen by Porsche Scion Ferdinand Peach for his personal 930 Turbo. It rides on 17-inch Fisk forged aluminum wheels reminiscent of the classic Fuchs windmill design seen on 911s in the 1960s and 1970s. The tire setup with 225-45 front and 275-40 rear Michelin Pilot Sport tires maintains a comparable overall rolling diameter to the 964 16-inch rims, and the front-to-rear contact patch difference remains proportionate. Inside, the revamped cabin showcases Recaro CS seats and Theon Turing rear seats, adorned with white leather complemented by woven Alcantara and leather panels. This design, featuring a checker with green strip graphic, extends to the dash and doors. The redesigned center console, incorporating a concealed wireless phone charging pad, is also wrapped in leather. A new Nardi steering wheel, deeper dish than previous Theon cars, graces the traditional instrument cluster. Notably, Original Porsche switchgear, interior door handles, fuel flap, and hood releases, knobs, and gauge rings are reimagined in billet aluminum. Numerous enhancements accompany Theon's mechanical makeover, including a military-spec wiring harness integrated into the body shell, shaving off 44 pounds compared to the 964. Upgrades at the front include modern dual air conditioning compressors and a new electric power steering pump. Adjustable adaptive dampers from Dutch specialist Tractive Suspension offer five damper rates manually selectable via a rotary controller on the center console. The brakes receive an upgrade to 964-993 Porsche 911 RS specification. Taking a spin, the GBR002's naturally aspirated 4.0-liter flat-six, Theon's most potent engine to date delivers 406 horsepower at 7,200 RPM and peak torque of 326 lb-ft at 5,800 RPM. The power boost, a 5% increase over Theon's previous 4.0-liter engine, results from a new ignition system and bespoke independent throttle bodies by British specialist Genvy. The engine also features a single-mass flywheel for improved response, transmitting power to the rear wheels through a Hewland 6-speed transmission and Wavetrack Torsen Limited Slip Differential. According to Holly, the GBR002 tips the scales at just 2,577 pounds, making it 440 pounds lighter than the 964 Series 911 Carrera 2 it's based on and a substantial 684 pounds lighter than the 992 Series 911 GT3.
Impressively, it also outweighs the Touring Package Equipped 911 GT3 by 646 pounds, which comes standard with a six-speed manual transmission. With 406 horsepower on tap, the GBR002 boasts a superior weight-to-power ratio compared to either GT3 variant, whose modern water-cooled 4.0-liter flat-six produces 502 horsepower at a thrilling 8,400 RPM. Performance-wise, the GBR002, with its distinct gearing and a lower engine rev limit, is not expected to match the GT3 Touring Package's 3.7-second 0-60 to mph acceleration time or reach its top speed of 199 mph. However, on real-world roads, the Fian car provides a sensation of speed and agility almost on par with the GT3. Its nimbleness is not solely attributed to its lighter weight. The more compact dimensions, 17.3 inches shorter and 2.2 inches narrower than the modern GT3 with a 7.3 inch shorter wheelbase, result in a feeling of having more road to explore. The torque factor also comes into play, with the Thean engine's 326 lbft being only about 6% less than that of the modern GT3 and the torque peak occurring 300 rpm earlier. The GBR002's power delivery is remarkable, especially when pushing the charismatic engine to its red line, filling the exquisitely finished cabin with the distinctive growl typical of air-cooled 911s. What truly sets it apart is the way the air-cooled 4.0-liter engine's substantial and broad torque, working seamlessly with the low-inertia flywheel, propels the car with a strong sense of speed. Consistent with Thean's other models, the GBR002 benefits from more weight over the front axle, courtesy of the front-mounted electric air conditioning system. Combined with a stiffer body structure and the responsive tractive shocks and torsion limited slip differential, this results in impressive turn and response. The electric power steering is finely tuned to match the steering effort reminiscent of the old non-assisted system, despite working with tires featuring a smaller contact patch. Overall, it exudes the feel of a more composed and precise handling car compared to a standard 964. Similar to the modern GT3 with the Touring package, Thean's GBR002 strikes a balance between speed and sophistication, surprisingly suitable for daily driving. The distinctive feature of Thean's approach lies in the skillful reinterpretation of vintage 911 iconography, seamlessly blending performance and practicality. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe if you like videos like this. Thank you.